just heard it. School districts doing all they can to keep kids safe. In Coppers Cove, they're actually leaning on parents to help out a little bit. Rosemont Crown is live at Coppers Cove ISD with how parents have become a part of the COVID screening process. Rosemont, this is required, right? Right, Pete. I mean, even parents who are bringing their kids for in-person classes are going to have to be hands-on. They are actually required to screen their kids for any symptoms of COVID-19 and report those results to school staff. Uh, and the district says it's not just the parents who are going to have to participate, it's kids too. For starters, they are required to wear a face mask and keep it on the whole school day. They're gonna have to keep their hands to themselves, which is a challenge for the little ones. And for the districts, they've been doing some rigorous cleaning and planning to get ready. In fact, the principal here at House Creek Elementary said teachers have been instructed to have students use hand sanitizer every two hours. He also says he and his staff are doing some extra measures to take care of their students since they are so young. I think the spacing is, is the biggest thing uh, that we have to be so aware that we're not getting just bunched up together. So we want to make sure that, that we're able to do that. I can say at our particular school we have about 60% of our students are attending face to face. As far as how students get to and from school, the school buses will be running as normal, obviously with some safety precautions, hand sanitizers, masks are required, and uh, seating charts. But also, Copperscove ISD is urging parents, if they can, to walk their kids to school or even bike. Reporting live in Copperscove, Rosamond Crown, KWTX News 10.